Is it wrong that I'm getting a little teeny tiny bit hopeful? That we're gonna that we're gonna pull yes. this off. It is wrong. It is wrong. It is wrong. Ah! This is a disaster. The internet, they're just lying liars. It's perfect! Worst craft ever, maybe. <coughs> that kind of smelled like turd. I'm Kim. And I'm Penn. Welcome to Craft Busters. Yes, we are. It's getting real. Yes. It, it is getting real. We are like craft investigators. Yeah, we're craft investigators. This one, I think, was the most sent to us of all time of yes. any of the videos, and it has actually gone viral. There is this guy from China, and if if it's legit and he really did this, this guy is, is an artist. Awesome. So he takes, take a look. He is repairing a, a sink using nothing but ramen noodles. Okay, so you see the broken sink. <laughs> He's stuffing in the ramen noodles, which are bizarrely, and then he adds the seasoning packet? What? And then. A, what we think is some epoxy right. resin. Um, and then he starts scraping it to shape it, scraping it and shaping it. Scraping and shaping it. And then he sands it. it. So he scrapes it, sands it, paints it, and he's done. Okay, are you ready? Sort of. Yay. Okay, you look like a bank robber a little bit. A kitchen bank robber. Oh, that was easy. <laughs> okay, now comes the fun part. We are going to take our... Cement. Our cement, which according to the internet, it's the epoxy reacts with the starch and the ramen to create this sort of resin that makes it so thick. All right, so it's a pretty good hole, um, cause it, like, we, um, we're already kind of starting to fill Hold it on, up. Hold on, you forgot a step, you forgot a step. That's at the end. No, ready? Really? Okay, that's just the weirdest part. You had the seasoning. Yeah. Cause, yeah, we're going beef. I think what we need to do now is maybe glue this. Honey, this is actually gonna be a sink that we're gonna use. And to, our kids are gonna go to college and use this. <laughs> and then they'll eat the ramen from the inside yeah. of it. Yeah, when times get tough. Yeah, ready? Our second layer of epoxy. You're being very liberal with epoxy. Yeah. That's good. We are gonna let this dry. The epoxy we purchased said it was gonna dry in five minutes. This glue takes about 15. We're gonna give it 30. To be like bone dry? Yeah. Okay, it's not bone dry. Okay. Nothing feels very scrapey. Yeah. If you want so it to feel like scrapey and dry. Yeah. It doesn't feel that way. Okay, let's wait. Hi, it's been 24 hours. Yeah, we waited extra long for this to dry. Yes. Um, there's some yard work going on behind us. Apologies for the ambient noise. Yes, so it is uh, hard. Yeah. But, uh, but sticky. But it's a little, it's not, it's dry, but I think that's just what ramen does. Yeah. Okay, so now our job, it, we're gonna try to shape it. Yeah, try yeah, yeah, it. for sure. I'm just trying to do the stop part. But see, here's the thing. Um, this, it has the texture and feel of a Rice Krispie treat. Okay, by the way, I have brought in an, um, I've called an expert to come in today because we kind of thought this was gonna be a disaster. He is gonna make this rain. Or he's gonna tell us what we did wrong. Yeah. I mean, it's not, <laughs> he's coming off. This is Nate. Nate makes lots of cool stuff. Nate knows what we're doing, and we're about to reveal our product. Well, I can't <laughs> wait to see it. Stop talking in the middle of that sentence. <laughs> All right, so, was I, I'm glad I didn't eat lunch, right? <laughs> I mean, if you're hungry, welcome to our, we're not all the way done. We haven't painted it yet. We're basically done. So it's lumpy, right? Mm -hmm. You get that? Yeah. Mm -hmm. It's a little lumpy. A little lumpy. Uh, you're gonna wanna smooth that out. We're gonna out smooth it out. Bit. Right, so Nate, I've been sanding this for a while. Um, and, okay. and so the, just sanding. The result is, is, is not, like I tried to chisel it, but it has the consistency, and we kinda wanted a dry consistency. Sure. It has more of the consistency of a Rice Krispie treat. Like, feel it. <laughs> so, what did we do wrong? Like, too much glue, maybe. Well, so, it's not hard, like, 
rock hard. This is something you want to be very hard yes. in order to sand it, so right. it's just probably rolling. I think you're about ready for paint at this stage. Yeah. Okay, let's do it. All of that. Guys, I think that looks amazing. No. No. Well, it looks, so it's gone from looking like a Rice Krispies treat to, um, Let's see, what does that look like? Coconut cake that's been maybe <laughs> pushed into the road a little bit? Run over. It looks it's like really roadkill. Mm -hmm. The video we're seeing, it is, you don't think it's fake. You just think there's a lot more time yeah. and the right supplies. Right, and understanding the way the materials work. That's 99% of it, knowing how the materials are going to react and then understanding how you, how and when you deal with them. Well, uh, Nate Shape, where can people find you on the um, internet? Find me at www.glass.work. Uh, make all sorts of shiny things, neon art, uh, do interiors for VIP lounges for Live Nation all over the country, building anything from top to bottom in those spaces. Could you do uh, this? Oh yeah. Yeah, easy. Yeah. But a pain in the butt. Yeah. Like, just buy a new sink at that point. <laughs> yeah, exactly. buy a new sink. Yeah, I got you. Okay. Yeah. okay. Well, thank you. And uh, thank you for watching. And um, if you try this, before you judge us, you try, try it. it. And yeah. then you leave us your picture. Yeah, show us how you did it right. Yeah. But I'm sure. Yeah. Anyway. Oh bye.